copper and aluminum metal clad feeders can be installed in any type of vertical application. Many contractors across the United States have found installing metal clad cables to be an efficient and more cost effective installation compared to traditional conduit wire and or bus duct installations. When installing MC feeder in a vertical application, the National Electric Code Section 330.30B requires that the overall MC assembly be secured every six feet. All MC cables must also meet Underwriters Laboratories UL 1569. That is the UL standard for safety of metal clad cables. Even though the UL 1569 requires an armor tightness test, this test does not apply to long vertical installations. This standard simply requires the conductors not slide more than half an inch in a 10 foot length. The test does not guarantee against additional slippage over time. The tightness between the armor and the conductor assembly assures the cable will have minimum movement with the armor during installation. The following is a description of the armor tightness test. All assemblies must meet this requirement, whether using copper or aluminum alloy conductors containing four gauge or larger conductors. The armor tightness test in UL 1569 requires that the conductors in a 10 foot sample of MC cable support a 30 pound weight. To pass this test, the conductors cannot slip more than one half inch for the first minute. The conductors can continue to move after the one minute time frame has elapsed. Until now, contractors have had to find ways to combat the movement of conductors under the armor for riser installations by using the same rules that are used for supporting conductors in conduit. Supporting conductors inside a raceway are covered under NEC table 300.19. This table requires conductor supports based on both the size of the conductor and the conductor material. For example, a 500 copper conductor installed in a vertical application must be supported every 40 feet compared to 95 feet for an equivalent impacity 750 aluminum alloy conductor. Because aluminum feeders are generally half the weight of the equivalent impacity copper feeders, fewer supports are required when converting to the aluminum alloy conductors. Traditionally, contractors have installed cable supports or wedges inside the conduit assembly to support the cables. When installing feeder size MC cable, contractors have found that the best way to provide required supports is to place offsets at specific intervals as required by NEC 300.19. Multiple offsets provide additional resistance, preventing the cables from sliding in the armor assembly. Southwire has developed an alternative product that provides the most efficient solution for commercial vertical installations over 10 stories, patent pending riser MC cable. Using riser MC cable eliminates the need for any type of special conductor supports or offsets because of the internal polymeric binder underneath the armor that holds the conductors in place. On high-rise residential and commercial jobs that require larger feeder cables, it becomes labor intensive to install offsets or conductor supports. In addition, there are space concerns when installing multiple vertical runs that increase the difficulty of installing offsets and supports. The riser MC cable assembly meets all requirements under NEC Article 330 for metal clad cable as well as UL 1569. Southwire provides installation instructions with each reel of riser MC cable stating that offsets or conductor supports of any type are not required. Now a contractor can install a vertical feeder from the basement all the way to the roof without having to worry about the additional time and cost of supporting the feeders inside the raceway. Because riser MC cable is listed as a type MC cable, it must be supported and secured externally every six feet. Southwire's riser MC cable is manufactured using Lumaflex 8000 series conductors and is currently available in sizes ranging from 3 aught through 750 KC mil. Many contractors are finding the value in using MC feeders in vertical applications instead of using conductors and conduit and or bus duct. Riser MC Cable further enhances the productivity benefits of MC Feeder in vertical installations.